You like it? We had Grace almost a year ago now. She's going to be one at uh, the beginning of April. When she was born was when we found out that she had Down syndrome. You want to be excited about having a, a new baby, but then there's a, a big you know, lump in your throat about what it all means. So it's tough. When we first started going to the children's hospital, the Down syndrome clinic, the way it was explained to us was that children with Down syndrome do everything that typical kids do. It just typically takes them twice as long to do so. Why would we just accept the fact that they say everything takes twice as long? We're after to get Gracie to walk on time, talk on time, and think just like a typically developing kid. When she doesn't have the ability to move like her peers, she's limited to what we put in front of her. So her development is limited to whatever we happen to put within her reach. Now unleash Gracie in a harness that provides some vertical support, that hugs her so she feels comfortable, but now a little bit of movement goes a long way. A little bit of toe movement when I'm standing to get me to twirl. A bilateral jump with both legs and she's off. What a harness can do is just give a chance for Gracie to never experience anything less than her own independence, her own self-guided life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness. But it's the pursuit of happiness that we have to do. And I fully expect that in 10 years, Gracie will be a 11-year-old full of adventure and causing havoc. I hope that um, she enjoys being a kid and doesn't have to deal with a lot of the, you know, you know, a lot of heart heartache from other kids or being, you know, not invited to things or, you know, treated any differently. Aww.